is going to have to take a spin in the Vomit Comet. Let's see who you've chosen. Kato? Kaya. Susan, what about you? Kaya. Richard, who did you vote for? Bye-bye, Kato. <laughs> My Tossi? Kato. <laughs> it's two to two. I don't think Kaya voted for himself. Who did you vote for? Kato. Yesterday, like a hair from 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 losing it, green, white, the whole bit, kind of woo. Uh, I'm actually a little sick. I'm white faced. I mean, who knows? But we we've seen him we go saw green. Kato you know what, if I go to the dog pound, big deal because at least if you start walking naked, I won't be here. <laughs> What do you mean, if? Yesterday, the guy's walking around nude the whole time. Everybody's naked. The whole day. Oh, yeah. yeah I'll day. take you. You think? Oh, that? I don't want a tan line. It's camp. It's 110 degrees. And, and you guys, trust me, it, okay, it shrinks before blow. it got cold in the pool. <laughs> I'm a grower, not a shower. <laughs> He's a grower, not a shower. <laughs> why, Tossie, why did you vote for Kato? He behaves like a woman. I think he's kind of weak. <laughs> he behaves like a woman? <laughs> What does that mean? He tell he me. He whines a lot. All he does is whine. Just bickering about everything. Feel it? The, the, oh. the queasiness you start to get like when you're on a boat. Feel it? Yep. Come on, Kato. Work it out. Let's see what happens when you go up against the vomit comet. Please come with me. You bet. Hey, Brooke, is there room for two? All right, Kato, we're going to start spinning you around. Then I'm going to read you a series of words and names. You have to tell me how many vowels are in each one. Answer eight correctly within 90 seconds, and you win. Otherwise, it's off to the dog pound. Let's put those 90 seconds on the net zero countdown clock. Your challenge begins when I read the first puzzle. Got it? Got it. Let's start spinning the vomit car. <laughs> OK, though. Oh, that queasy stuff. Robinson is five, not yeah. seven. Oh, I did the, oh, I did it, the English version. Oh, but you got seven right. You were so close. I'll just, I'll just roll over there. Yeah. Darvo, you're right over, honey. Come on over, baby. <laughs> Unfortunately, close doesn't count. You're still off to the dog pound. OK. Kato's off to the dog pound with Darva. Two down and four to go. Congratulations. 
Let's check out our next challenge, Earthquake Island. To succeed at this one, you'll need great speed and nerves of steel. There's a flag on each ladder. Your job will be to bring them both up to the top. And there's a reason it's called Earthquake Island. The platform will be bucking and tilting the whole time. Someone's performance might be a little shaky. It's time to choose the loser. We'll find out if this is the big one when we return.